Yes, sir. It is written in the history of Noah that when he went and closed to the door of his boat, they said, oh, knocking on his door. When the water got up, no open unto us. Mm -hmm. He said, I can't. The Bible said it will say it to you on this day, open unto us, asking the Savior, will not we with you in the street? But he said, I know you're not. Yes, sir. He declares that he don't know you if you are not a believer. Yes, sir. He means he don't know you as one to be saved by him. You go with those, the Bible says, who work a naked. You go along with them. The older one said, oh, they will say, would that I had taken him away with the apostle. Yes, sir. After it had came to me, meaning the truth, yes, sir. I let the enemy deceive me. This is bad. I want to say to you, my beloved listeners, that you are living in the judgment now. Yes, sir. This is the judgment, and we are trying to separate you from that which God came to destroy. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Because you have no rights to go along with it when you don't belong to white people. Yes, sir. You belong to yourself. Yes, sir. You're an independent people, created from the nation of free people. Yes, sir. You don't need to go nowhere but to yourself. Yes, sir. There will be a great separation. Yes, sir. So I say it is on now. Yes, sir. As the Bible teaches you, when you see people being called by the name of God in your midst, having his mouth, Yes, sir. That's the day of resurrection and the great separation. Yes, sir. You must be separate. Ignorant people, having not the knowledge of this scripture, of the Bible, they will say to you, why separate? Yes, sir. That's a lover of the enemies. Yes, sir. And they don't want to be separated. But they will be separated. They just The Holy One teaches us that on that day, you that have made friends with the enemy will wish that the distance between you and them was the distance of the East and the West. Yes, sir. But tell you the truth, you begin wishing that as soon as you know yourself. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You that running around wanting to integrate and marry with them, that won't stand. As the Bible teaches you, your agreement with hell will not stand. Right. You thought by marrying with the enemy who holds power over you, you would be getting into that power. But you are not. He's carefully to keep you out of that power. Yes, sir. There is many of our people in Washington. Some of them now is entering into the cabinet. He will let them have a seat close to him. Yes, just for him to help 
him who has destroyed you to keep you here. Yes, sir. A Savior is born. Right. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Who is it that need to be saved? It's you yes, sir. and me. Yes, sir. You don't belong here, but an enemy have you tied by legal rights of the law. Yes, sir. So therefore, you've got to break a loose yourself yes, sir. in order to be able to get freed again. Yes, sir. Wonderful. Yes, sir. So this man worked hard to try to make for himself a son to come and save us. A people that was out of the family and out of the society of their own better people. That the God of the people goes to work to make for them a savior. Yes, sir. This is wonderful. Yes, sir. So on this day, night, pardon me, 19, and yeah, 19 February 1926, we are face to face with the truth that today we can say the man that was born 1800 February the 26th. is here with us. To do what to save us? It's, it's wonderful. To save us from what? From the destruction of our enemy, whom oh, he have declared with an oath that he will deliver you from your enemies and destroy them who has destroyed you. And this is a wonderful thing. This came to us, his boy, 18, seven, to seven. February the 26th. Yes, sir. A Savior was born on that day. Yes, sir. For us. Yes, sir. Sometimes we make a mistake. Yes, sir. Not an error, but make a mistake. Yes, sir. Sometimes. As we are, are reaching out for more. Right. We're forgetting that which we have already have learned. Yes, sir. And counting it inferior to what we see before. Yes, sir. Go ahead, be on your part. Yes, sir. We're going to soon dismiss you. As there is so many of us who have to find places, some of us may want to go home. <laughs> to be taught the wisdom of this world, how that one of our great scientists yes, sitting down playing with two pieces of steel discovered the birth of a nation. Yes, sir. That he could give birth to and teach them his wisdom. Yes, sir. And then make 
them to rule us for 6,000 years yes, sir. until the great Mahdi, a lion person, makes his appearance. Yes, sir. This has been done. Now, the, the great Mahdi is here, and now he's ready to erase the kingdom of Yaqub and build the people in the kingdom that will stand for him. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. The people that we have been bothering to think of, they don't have nothing to boast of. <laughs> Ask them who made them. <laughs> they will say, God. <laughs> then you ask them, who is God? They have deceived the slaves and the slaves people all over the earth concerning God in the heaven. You look up in the sky. You ought to tell them, say, you don't look like a sky bone baby. <laughs> yes, sir. You look like a baby bone on the earth. Right. You know you're too dumb to argue with him. But bring him here. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. We will argue with him. Yes, sir. He went to work after he brought us from our native land and people to make a mockery out of us, but he have as yet to do one as great as our father did for him. Yes, sir. And the hills and cave sides of Europe. Yes, sir. Our father ran him out into the hills and cave sides of Europe. Yes, sir. Made monkeys and apes out of them. Yes, sir. <laughs> made him to grow alamon tail <laughs> and spit over a human. Yes, sir. Thank you for that. And they still just tell me around the hospital that some come here with a little monkey tail. The monkey is his relative. <laughs> Only one is civilized, and other is uncivilized. <laughs> and that's a curse our people put on, who refuse to listen to Moses. Yes, sir. They made him a monkey, made him to eat swine flesh. And he's called apes and swines in the Quran. Yes, sir. He loves swine. Yes, sir. Then he make you eat swine. Yes, sir. <laughs> Though you read in the Bible, you so-called good Christian. <laughs> Not only should you eat the swine, but you shouldn't catch his cock. You'll raise up your head and tell God what's wrong with it. 
You'll raise up your head and tell God what's wrong with you. Talking back to the man who made it. They made the hog not for the hog to be eaten. No, they made the hog to get the poison out of the hog to make medicine capable of reaching the white man diseases. Yes, sir. And he still uses that hog for his medicine. You saw in the paper, I heard over the radio here just a few weeks ago about them using the hog. Some of them even want to put the plaster on of hog flesh. He know you don't like it. He do that for evil. Yes, apply a piece of hog to your body. Uh, he know that God would not like to welcome you in the kingdom with a piece of forbidden flesh of his own forbidden own. So when they go to talking about I must put some hog flesh to you, that's best. Tell him no. If there is no other flesh, let me go ahead. <laughs> there is enough poison poke worms into one square inch of the hog to kill you. Yes, sir. But you sit down dining with him and say it's good. And as soon as that flesh gets inside of you, start creating members of its family by the million. Mm -hmm. Yep. They call sickness the white man drugs that he's preparing for you over the old drugs. It is only to make you die faster. I'm only telling you the truth. They yes. will bear me with you. A Savior's born. Yes, sir. Who needed a Savior in a Western week? Yes, sir. We need a Savior. Yes, sir. You are hurting and painting and ask for help, a drug to help you to bear your pain. Mm -hmm. And he gives you a drug that will create another pain. Yes, sir. This is true. He won't tell you to go and pray to Allah and try to help you. No, because that he didn't serve Allah. Mm -hmm. And since he didn't serve Allah, he can't look to Allah for cure. Yes, sir. Well, Muhammad, do you go to the doctor? Do you have pain? Are you sick? And all of their affliction, he was afflicted. Yes, sir. But the pleasure of Allah will prosper. Yes, with sir. him. Yes, sir. Thank you over that. Yes, sir. That's right. You That's right, the apostle. Shoot it off your mouth to try to make a mark of Go me. Ahead. Yes, sir. How can a man retrieve the drowning man? He don't have a boat yes, sir. to go out there. Yes, sir. Now I'll bother you to put around his neck. Yes, sir. So he have to leap in there and battle the water and suffer oh. as he suffers. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. What is yes, your sir. Apostle? This is what I am doing. Yes, sir. I am battling that which you battle. Yes, sir. 
and this shows the love of me for you. Yes, sir. We love you, dear Holy Apostle. Yes, sir. If God makes the man to go through all of your suffering, it is dead to approve his choosing. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. To let you know that I choose one that loves you like I love you myself. Yes, sir. And that he's willing to go through even death to rid you out of the hands of death. Yes, sir. I could be living in Asia, Africa, anywhere in the Western world or out of the Western world. I can live. Yes, sir. Because I am the brother of the righteous. Yes, sir. So, I said to you that don't think I suffer because I can't help myself or I'm condemned by sin to be suffering with you. No, sir. I'm not condemned by no sin that I have committed. Go ahead, no, sir. Peace, peace, dear apostle. Because I have not sinned. No, sir. Go ahead. But show me the history Go ahead. of any prophet of the past. Listen. I'm a messenger. Yes, That's sir. Right. That's right. Go ahead, dear apostle. Show me their history and see if one escaped mockery yes, sir. of the people. That's right. Yes, sir. That's right. They all were mocked and accused. Yes, sir. Of the evil of the people. Yes, sir. That he was trying to rid them of. If the last prophet must cover and fulfill the last prophet before him, should not he go through with what he see the people? going through with until he can reach their hearts? Yes, sir. He is a wise glass prophet. Yes, sir. Yes, he is. Go he lived with you in your midst. Yes, sir. And then yet after living with you and humbling himself yes, sir. to the same that you are buckled to, and can't get out of it. Help you to unleash yourself yes, sir. from that which you cannot. That's right. Should then he be made a mockery? No, sir. No, sir. No, sir. No, sir. Regardless of what you